Hi everyone, welcome back to Warclara channel. Today I have some nice updates for you that we did in July. Let's go. July was busy for us. We start from the small integration, but, but it's very, very important to have, especially for new users. It's enough tutorials. So right now, when you create a new organization, you will be welcomed with this screen and you will be able to select among checking the knowledge base that we have some time or start the in-app tutorial. So the in-app tutorial is something I wanna share you about. So first of all, you can access it on this link here. You can always hide it so it uh, you know hides forever. And you can re-instantiate re-instanti it from the help center by getting to getting started section and clicking channel tutorial widget. So tutorial widget is simply, as it says, is a hands-on experience and we'll have more chapters to come to make you are more productive from the day one. It's uh, supposed to be very simple and easy to follow and probably will take uh, a few minutes to chapter or like maybe one hour for all the tutorials we have in place, enough for you to become productive. So this looks um, like you start the chapter and you're being uh, walked through along the process, like I see here, nothing fancy. You've probably seen a lot of similar solutions in the past uh, with other um, tools. So we just joined the pack. All right, so this is it um, uh, for in-app tutorials. One um, important feature we have for um, for the chat, we have GIST integration, so we can avoid um, using the um, just images or anything else. And since we are tying up the space for each organization, it also helps save costs on storage. Uh, next goes optimistic updates. Simply take it as the message now has status, uh, which is uh, signifying if it's sent or not. It also helps you handle the offline state which makes uh, overall work more um, predictable. In the past, we weren't able to uh, show that message is not sent. So now we are fully covering this case. Another aspect we have worked on was finance. So finance, as you remember from last update, we added the bank transactions in, and the integration with the banks. Like you, yeah, like you see here, let me move me. Uh, let me move myself from here and make some space. So the bank transactions are here. There's nothing fancy about that. Uh, what's interesting is right now we are working on Zara integration. It takes more time than we thought. They are pretty outdated. But um, we have some other sections added recently, which is revenue. Uh, we chose the revenue for specific periods. I don't think I have enough data in uh, the staging, but it draws the charts and it also shows the distribution per categories. Same for expenses, but for any um, debits from the connected accounts. You can also work out the manual expenses on top of that. And there is overview. For overview simply shows um, the actual net income over the time. Let me try to do this here and see if I can uh, fetch some nice stats. Yeah, at least it's drawing something. Um, it's pretty hard to test it and show something on the demo because it's really working with the test account of the real banks. So simply take it as showing you a quick stats on how uh, your organization is doing financially. Now, um, we also add a few more nice tweaks to chats. Uh, first is attachment for support widget. So for any project that acts as a support center, now can easily retrieve the um, attachments in the messages, which simplifies work of the support center. And there is also extra addition on that part for uh, following up via email because the users who started uh, writing something and then left your application where you have embedded widget might not follow up on the conversation or question and it just makes it hard to, for them to um, follow up along the support case. And despite the fact that we also have enabling um, notification for desktop widget, uh, not everyone is using it. So now email um, follow-up helps uh, to keep the user in, uh, in up to date. That's it. We are working on a few more things that will be pretty interesting and captivating your attention, uh, such as artificial intelligence integration and finalizing the finances uh, section so it can be used by anyone and uh, some other interesting features coming along. Thanks for your time and see you later.